Hello everyone. In the next couple of minutes, I would like to introduce you to the Norwegian writer Jan Fosse, winner of the 2023 Nobel Prize in Literature. Let's take a sneak peek into the life and works of Jan Fosse. Jan Olaf Fosse was born in 1959 in the Norwegian countryside on the west coast of Norway. He is a successful playwright and author in Norway and around the world. That his works have been translated into more than 40 languages is an ample proof of his stature as a widely read author. Some of his works are very influential, are relevant in the contemporary modern world. Fosse's literary career began with the novel Red Black, which was published in 1983. Some of his notable plays are The Name, Winter, Never Shall We Part and A Summer's Day. The last volume of his work Septology was shortlisted for the 2022 Booker Prize. It is made up of seven novels and is considered as Fosse's magnum opus, his greatest work. This book tells the story of an aging painter who over the course of seven days tries to make sense of art, religion, identity and family. The work has strong autobiographical undercurrents and pays a tribute to his late wife and his own work as a painter. Although primarily a playwright, Fosse has also written poems, essays, translations and even children's books. His compositions in the Ninoshk variety of Norwegian language spoken by less than 20% of the population suggests his rootedness in the local landscape and identity. At the same time, he has been able to address universal and timeless themes. Therein lies the genius and mastercraft of Jan Fosse. Fosse is a proponent of what is known as slow prose and his works are often compared to those of Henrik Ibsen for their modernist concerns and those of Jacques Derrida for expressing the unspoken. Many critics also find a veritable influence of Samuel Beckett and Fosse's play Someone is going to come reminds one of Samuel Beckett's Waiting for Godot. The Nobel Committee lauded him for his innovative plays and prose which has given voice to the unsayable. For first time readers of Fosse, I would recommend beginning with Fosse's trilogy. It is a story of two lovers trying to find a place in the world. I hope you have had an overview of Jan Fosse and his works. Thank you.